From News 19 and meteorologist Daniel Bonds, yesterday we did manage to make it into the lower 60s for a large portion of the Midlands. 61 degrees in the capital city. Haven't had any rain so far during the work week, but it looks like we'll get some rain on Friday, which has been the trend. We've got rain in the forecast for tomorrow. This would be the seventh straight Friday with measurable rainfall. Kind of an odd thing there to talk about. Kind of an odd stat. Elevated fire danger for today. That's until 7 o'clock because we've got very dry air in place. So you do want to avoid any kind of outdoor burning today. Mainly sunny today. A little bit warmer. We've got that rain on the way for Friday evening. Kind of break down that forecast for you in just a second. It looks like Saturday's going to be dry. Pollen levels will continue to be high today and tomorrow. They do improve over the weekend, but temperatures will be a little bit cooler. It looks like 29 degrees unofficial low temperature at the Columbia Metropolitan Airport, 32 Sumter and in Orangeburg. Here's our current setup. High pressure is going to shift a little bit more towards the east as it does. Moisture is going to start to increase. We're expecting those clouds to increase as well. So mostly cloudy skies tonight as we go into Friday, which is your St. Patrick's Day, last day of the work week as well. Clouds kind of stick around, mostly cloudy skies. And then as that cold front continues to make its way towards the Midlands and the Palmetto State, there's going to be a pretty good chance for rain during the evening, it looks like. This is 6 o'clock. Now, you can go an hour, maybe an hour or two, both sides of this. But right now, looks like a pretty good chance for rain. Those showers continue to move basically from west to east. That's 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, more shower activity. By the time we get to midnight, most of the rain in the upstate ends. Showers start to decrease for at least portions of the Midlands. By the time the sun rises Saturday morning, the rain's out of here. The clouds will start to decrease. Should see partly cloudy skies for your Saturday. So as far as rainfall totals, this is how our forecast model kind of sees it. Anywhere from about a quarter to a half inch of rain as that line of showers moves through the Midlands. As of right now, I'm not expecting any thunderstorm activity. Today, though, will be dry, mainly sunny. High is in the mid to upper 60s to near 70 degrees. Tonight, mostly cloudy, not nearly as cold with these lows dropping into the mid to upper 40s to near 50 degrees for some of us. St. Patrick's Day, pretty warm, 75 degrees. Breezy at times with those winds out of the southwest, 15 to 20 miles per hour, and that rain moving in during the evening hours, as we mentioned. This is what we're looking at for the next seven days. A little cooler Saturday, but it should be dry, dry Sunday. You'll notice it's still pretty chilly. Could even have another freeze and or frost Sunday or Monday morning. Spring equinox is Monday, still feeling like wintertime, mid-50s for highs, upper 50s on Tuesday. Right now, we've got a very small chance for rain as a low-pressure system kind of skirts up the coast. A little bit warmer by Wednesday with highs closer to what we expect for this time of the year, mid-60s by Wednesday.